Hi, this is Larice West, Business Voice and Peak Performance Coach. And I want to talk to you today about Brian Scott's meditation, Large Sums of Money Come to Me Quickly and Easily. I was assigned this by my business mentor, Fabian Fredrickson, I think three years ago when I was doing a challenge, an income challenge. And it was interesting you listen to it it's a half an hour there's one you can do overnight that doesn't work for my body to listen to something overnight but you could do that also and i listen to it twice a day what i found and i've talked about this the kind of resistance that can come up when we're trying to do something really good or we're trying to move to the next level right what happened for me is i would be listening to it and i could hear myself resisting it I could hear my thoughts. I felt kind of mm, like, I don't want to hear this. And my goal was th for $21,000 for three months. So you're supposed to set kind of a big, hairy, audacious revenue goal, a, a BHARG. <laughs> and even though I, I know I was resistant for quite a bit of it, what happened was I ended up earning 18000 in that time period, which is nothing to complain about. I actually feel that I was successful. So um, it was working with me. It was working on me, even though I was resistant to it. So I've been doing it again. Starting in November, I started doing it again. I don't have any resistance anymore. Occasionally, I'll get distracted. And I'll be doing other things. But what I've been doing is feeling into it because the key to manifesting. It's not just having the mental idea. It's like we have to have our, our emotions in it. And of course we have to take actions. So just saying, mm, I want a million dollars <laughs> and feeling really good about it. It doesn't make any sense if we're nowhere, absolutely positively nowhere near, we're not working with hundreds of thousands of people, that kind of thing, right? Usually the people who are making that kind of money are serving lots and lots and lots and lots of people. So we want to have a goal that makes sense for us. I had already previously, so that was $6,000 a month. I had already previously made, my maximum was 13000 in a year, in a month. So that's not a ridiculous goal for me to, to make 7,000 in a month. I had been up and down, so I wanted some consistency, but that was not an unrealistic goal for me because I'd already made more. I made a number of $8,000 months, a number of 7,000, number of $9,000 months. So it's not like I was saying I want a $20,000 month, which I never had made, right? So we want to look at something's a stretch. Consistency was, was one of my challenges, making the money consistently. So, which is part of being in business, there are ups and downs, but there can be some, some big swings, right? Which is why we want to have some prudent reserves for those times. But so we want to set a nice goal for ourselves and then, uh, and then feel into it while we're getting, while we're hearing this meditation. And it's important to listen to it in headphones because it's, it's got, Two, it's going to say large sums of money, large sums of money, come to me quickly and easily, come to me quickly and easily, you know, from multiple sources or multiple sources on a continuous basis. And it doesn't, it's not crazy making, it really isn't. But what's happening is one part of it is occupying our, our conscious mind and the other part is going into our subconscious because the subconscious is where the stuff lies. The subconscious is where all of the things um, that limit us lie. They're the programming from our family, our parents. They're all of that stuff that we're not even aware of that is creating resistance. No, no, no. My parents never earned that much. No, 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 no. Who am I to deserve? You know, like all, all the limiting beliefs that we're not even aware of are in the subconscious. So they've got this kind of programming. It's set up so that our subconscious gets reprogrammed in terms of this is in terms of finances. It's basically how everything else works where we're working on changing limiting mindsets, which we all have that, you know, cause our limits, um, cause our resistance. So listen to it in headphones, even if you've got little plugins, you know, do whatever you can do so that you get that going. Occasionally I'll just listen to it out in the open, but most of the time I've got my headphones on with my iPad 
because I, I want the maximum effect of it. So, you know, three years later I did it. Um, and it was funny because when we started, there were less, I think it was like 800,000 listens now. And now you'll see it's 3.7 million. I myself has li have listened to it dozens of times. So <laughs> I've added to that. And I know a whole community of people who've been, you know, listening and listening. So we're enriching Brian Scott, which is great, right? Because he's enriching us. So um, go ahead and enjoy that. Notice if there's resistance and be gentle with yourself with it. It's normal. Okay. It's normal because you're changing your money mindset. Okay. Enjoy.